Hi everyone and welcome back. Um, what are we looking at this week? Well, some exciting news. Wartorn Studios has its second Kickstarter running. Again, what's Wartorn Studios? What are they to do with? Blah, blah, blah. Well, as you would have seen in a few of my videos previous, I've been using Textures Rollers and they're available on the Facebook page. So here's a quick peek of the rollers, some of the rollers from the first Kickstarter. There we go. Absolutely lovely. Brilliant for building terrain, dioramas, etc. So let's have a quick look at the new stuff on the computer. Right, so here we have a concrete style roller. So you've got concrete blocks, lines with metal girders. Should be quite useful for industrial, sci fi type terrain builds and there you go just quickly show it fits over the roller so moving on to the next one it's a damaged wall it's slightly different to the one from kickstarter one there's a lot more texture to this it's not quite such a deep um recess into it there's some score lines into it so it's be used slightly fantasy it can be used industrial or even on a general sort of building type construction the next one is a uh, same again a damaged wall but this one's got the fine brickwork in it and a lot of texture into the plaster work or the decaying plaster I should say so, as we move around you can see more and more of the details quick flip over I expect to have a look I'm gonna flip it oh no we're gonna zoom in okay so we're just zoom around and there we go so that just shows you the fits over Right, on to the next one. So the next one is a fine brick. There was a brick roller in Kickstarter 1, but this is a lot that was a larger brick design. This is a very fine crisp brick design, which will take on XPS because I proved it when I did some resin stamps with this type of fine detail. And we move on to the next one, which is the same brick roller, but this one is actually all weathered, so as you can see the plaster started to go in between the joints and just a bit more wear and tear on it so I think this one would be quite nice I see both of these rollers actually been quite useful within the model railway community because of the scale of them I think they'll fit quite nicely to the final one so this is like a metal type boards um, you've got some studs a bit sticking out these dig into the XPS or clay to give like nail holes and then you've got some drawing marks so another industrial style futuristic right so there you have it some exciting new textures coming along there's a lot more to go with it so nip over to the kickstarter page there's another video there explaining some of the other bits that are being worked on um i'm really looking forward to this and if you're wondering why i may be a bit twitchy because normally i've got titty but today i've got lightning sat on my lap um, I cannot move out here without a cat something that's so I feel like an evil mastermind sat here stroking me cat and hey, hey world domination right um, as I said nip over have a look I will be producing these and obviously doing some builds with them in the future as and when they go live I'm not printing them at the moment sit um, because these are all prototype designs so they'll probably be tweaked about a little bit before they're ready for production so thank you all for watching and thank you to everyone who's subscribed. The channel has grown lovely over the last few weeks, even though I've been very busy. I've been ill as well and haven't produced much. Hopefully we'll get back to normal fairly soon as things start to calm down. And all I have left to say, thank you for watching. Hit that like button, subscribe, and I'll see you all soon. Cheers.